NSDCRS 3 rail vendors recover 1,600 rail sleepers and clips. Says culprits will be prosecuted. Says troops are on hill arrest anyone found vandalizing government properties. Vandals should desist from such action as gallant men are on watch. In an effort to curtail high rates of crimes of vandalizing rail track in the state, troops have been deployed to various locations to protect lives of government and citizens. Nigerian Security and Civil Defense Corps Kaduna State Command have arrested three suspected rail track sleepers vandals in the state. Addressing journalists in Kaduna while parading the suspects, the state commandant of SCDC, Nuruddin Abdullahi, says three suspects were arrested with rail sleepers and clips around Zangidi in Jama'a's local government area of the state. Says two of the suspects are receiving medical treatment and this was the highest arrest of real vandal. The troops have recorded in the operations last month. Vandalized railway materials was apprehended with three suspects by our men of the Nigeria Security and Civil Defense Corps, uh, Kafanchan area. Our men on a tip of embedded a location of vandalization at Jagindi and met criminals vandalizing railway sleepers. On sighting officers, they took to their heels. One of them by name Monday was injured during the raid and had been transferred to General Hospital Kafanchan where he is receiving treatment. Equally, on the 6th of April, Another arrest based on intelligence report from an informant that a truck was sighted loading vandalized railway sleepers at Delhi around Jagindi. Officers of the Nigeria Security and Civil Defense Corps were mobilized. A few hours later, the truck was intercepted at an army checkpoint at Gerti village of Jama'a local government carrying 1,600 railway sleepers and clips and was transferred to the NC, uh, NSCDC command alongside the suspect named Nanjuma Mohammed and the Khalifa Said for further investigation. Another su suspected case of vandalization was reported uh, and the uh, arrest was made. The suspect was arrested with railway sleepers uh, clips. Uh, the suspect is currently in detention and under medical observation due to threats of insanity he is exhibiting. Uh, these people, they are saboteurs, so the Nigeria Security and Civil Defense Corps is all out to track them and to take the necessary uh, action in order to bring them to the book. Now we are calling these people to stop it. This is act of vandalization and it's against the effort of the government in bringing life easy to the people. So we are calling uh, them to stop this act because we will not relent in our effort to track them down. Also, other arrest was made in connection with rape and other related offenses. NSCDC are saddled with the mandate to protect government infrastructures in the state as the civil defense are on their heel to arrest anyone found when the Lysing rail track will be persecuted. He added that NSCDC operatives have also arrested other suspected of rapists and other related crimes during the period. Abdullahi warned the people to desist from such crime which is act of sabotaging the efforts of government to make lives easy to its citizens says the operative will not compromise its standard to allow such evil acts continue in the states. Nuradun Abdullahi, Commandant NSCDC, Kaduna State. 
In recent times, rail track vandal has become one of the major crimes committed in the state, which has caused rail derail in Kaduna State. All aware, the Nigeria Security and Civil Defense Corps is saddled with the protecting of critical national infrastructure. So it is our mandate to see that we protect all these infrastructures, be it railway, NEPA, uh, pipeline, uh, NNPC equipment, everything. So it is our mandate and that is what we have been doing. Now, as you can see, uh, we are steadfast on that uh, based on the arrest which we have made. Now, we have arrested 1,600 clips, which is the highest number of vandalization that has occurred within the period. So we are calling the attention of these people that it is not something that you can just carry and put it in your pocket. So it is very real as we are all out and our eyes are open. Anything that is concerning vandalization to uh, take charge of it. So I am calling the attention of these people wherever they go and vandalize these uh, uh, materials and the equipment, we are going to apprehend them. So it is not an easy tax. It's better they stop it because we cannot compromise in any way. Whoever is caught, we are sure that he is going to face the law. Zainab Ahmed, Voice TV, Nigeria.